This is terrifying. Oh, hello. My name is Lauren. Welcome back to the vlog. Welcome back to Hissy Fit. Welcome back to my very fancy Subaru. I know you're impressed. Anyways, we're currently in the parking lot of my face people. I don't even know what they're officially called. But yeah, I'm here to get my face fixed. I use very, very formal terminology. So I think I've said on this channel before, in fact, I did a whole video on like a face mask. So if you haven't watched that, what are you doing with your life? But yeah, I think I've said before that my skin used to break out pretty nicely. Like it, it did its job. And I know, arguably, like things could have been a lot worse. And so I kind of just accepted it for a long time. Like I definitely tried. Oh, I tried just about everything. I tried so many products, like low end, high end, in between. I went to two different dermatologists. I went on antibiotics for a while. I did a lot of things and just nothing really worked. And basically what I was informed, they're like, well, the next step would be you going on Accutane. But I didn't want to do that. I, I mean, everybody is obviously like, it's a personal choice. I just felt like the effects or repercussions or whatever you want to call it of acne was something I would take over the effects of Accutane. I was just, no, thank you. For whatever reason, this last January, I was just like, no, I'm not doing this. I am not doing this anymore. So I did a lot of research and there's this place here. It's actually in Washington. I live in Portland, Oregon. So I pop up here called the Acne Treatment Center, actually. I think I started all your like treatments in February. And since then, Ooh, ah, ah, yeah, I'm literally so pleased with my face. <laughs> oh, the, like, still to this day, like, I can't get over it. But, yeah, actually, I think that I'm gonna grab my uh, before and after pictures from them, so this is it. This is, this is the difference. So yeah, I have another appointment with them today. I go every six weeks now. They just give me a facial pretty much because I'm actually gonna go in there and they're gonna fix my face. So I figured why not bring you along? We can all get our faces fixed together. Also, make sure that you like this video and subscribe to Hissy Fit. This is why I don't wear ponytails. Hello, everyone. Hi. Welcome to the internet. The full acne treatment today. So we are going to wash your face, take your pictures to compare them from last time, and then we're going to put you under steam. We're going to do some extractions, my favorite. <laughs> and then we're going to um, do some toning and a sulfur mask, and then we're going to put on some moisturizer and some sunscreen, your best friend. You're all hired. I've never looked better. <laughs> Do you like popping zits for a living? Oh my god, I love it. I think I really would too. It's like when so I started coming fun. here, I was yeah. like, if I could go back to school, I would do this. <laughs> this would be my jam. <laughs> yeah. I love it. It's so much fun. It's just, it's rewarding. Like as soon as mm -hmm. I, you know, go to extract, I get to get all this stuff out. And yeah, I was gonna say, it's probably really satisfying. It really is. This is terrifying. So lovely. <laughs> Do you have blue eyes? No. They're very brown. And what's your natural hair color? Blonde. Just not this blonde. Okay. Okay. Yeah. Well, I've been told it's hard to match my skin tone because the problem is I'm well, in winter. Mm -hmm. It's easy in summer. But mm. I get so pale, but my undertones are still more they olive undertones. Yeah, and so it's like they don't typically make colors this pale with an olive undertone. Yeah, no, That's why, like, the powder I get from Olima, I get from them because they have, like, 60, like, color shades. Oh, dang. But, yeah, so they make an olive, but they make olive zero. <laughs> oh, and that's you. <laughs> and that's me. <laughs> um, I have another color that I want to try. I mean, that looks like my face. So we're now back. You're in my cupboard, as you should be. I'm eating peanut butter and celery like the grown woman I am. But I thought real quick I would show you all of the stuff I bought because I pretty much had to completely buy them out. I now only use very specific products on my face, which is pretty much what has cleared my skin. So I use a restorative cleanser from them and their Moisture Balance Toner. When I first started, I was using different products from them, but since my skin got clear, now it's pretty much just trying to keep it like hydrated and like plush and soft and nice. And I love both of these. And also they smell really nice. And also when you lay all these products out in your bathroom, they don't look ugly. So that's nice. After the toner, I use this Mandelic Serum and this I know you can buy online. This is from the brand Face Reality. So if you're interested, this is what I use. This is from Face Reality. And then I also use at night another product from them. This is their Hydra Balance Hydrating Gel. This is a really nice moisturizer. I know you could use this in the morning and at night, but I in the morning, actually use this 
moisture balancing cream, which is also from the acne treatment center that I go to. So I also use the sunscreen from Tizo and then this acne med that I get from there for spot treatments. But that is literally everything that goes on my face. Like I said, I pretty much had to buy them out because I only go there every like six weeks right now. When I first started, I would go every two weeks where they clean your face, they pop all your zits, they give you an enzyme mask and then, or at least for me, this is what they were doing. It's different for everybody, but for me, they've been giving me an enzyme mask and then they do like a peel after. So I just got a peel. Mm. Mm, mm. But it's just like one of those mini ones, so like my whole face doesn't peel off. But yeah, that is pretty much everything that I use. I bought so much stuff from them because I just have to like stock up. But yeah, it's about 2.30 now. I'm going to do all these dang dishes. <laughs> hey. Get a little bit of work done before we have to go to this shoe party, which sounds a lot more exciting than it'll probably be, but you're coming with me regardless. <laughs> I'm editing this video of myself right now. I have lipstick all over my teeth. Like my two front buck teeth. There's lipstick just all over for like half of this video. And you know what? I'm just gonna hope none of you notice even though I'm now pointing it out. Let me know if you saw it. Actually, don't let me know. Let's just leave this one to die. Oh, okay, I gotta get ready. <laughs> so I forgot to mention earlier that when I bought 10,000 things from my face place, I also bought makeup from them. So the makeup that I use on my face, I'll show you everything. Most of it is from this brand called Priya. This primer, okay. Boop. Oh well, you ready? Oh, that was a lot. My face is not that big. Ooh, yeah. Basically, there are certain ingredients for whatever reason my skin reacts more to and it breaks out. And for some people, they can put whatever product on their face and it's fine, but mine will break out. But those ingredients are not in this line, so I'm safe to use like anything from them. So this is their Essential Cover Acne Safe Foundation Primer. If you also have a face that breaks out, I would definitely recommend just trying this skincare line because a lot of the time what ends up happening is you have like stuff that you want to cover and so then you cover it but then the stuff that you're using to cover it just makes more stuff that you need to cover and it's just like a big stupid circle jerk so i also use from priya this is their cream foundation stick i hate this piece of hair because it's always making me look like a chicken she color matched me earlier i'm in sandy beige i am very difficult to color match i've been told that by anyone that has ever tried to color match me in the winter anyway there's just this certain ingredient that is a lot of the time found in most liquid foundations that will break me out and my skin did break out a tiny bit from traveling and since i got like a peel and extractions done today it is just a little bit more red than normal. Yeah, I really like this stuff, highly recommend it. It's just in general, but especially if your face breaks out, I would definitely recommend my dudes. But anyway, we are getting ready for, I just call them shoe parties, I don't even know. Oh, Mr. Lauren which is what I call my boyfriend. He's very involved in like men's streetwear and shoes, like tennis shoes and stuff like that. And he actually like recently opened up his own little store and is out here doing the thing. So I end up going to a lot of shoe events <laughs> with him and I just call them shoe parties. I don't even know, we'll go to places and he'll tell me all the stuff about how it's made or how like it affected like streetwear culture or something and like he'll go into all this detail and I'm sure, and it really is very interesting wonderful, amazing stuff. It's just, I'm not really interested. <laughs> and I've told him, I'm like, you know, I'm for coming, I'm for supporting you, but this is basically the equivalent of me taking you into a Sephora and being like, look at Fenty's new line, there's so many shades, and freaking out, which he will also very politely stand there and listen to me talk, but at the end of the day, he's gonna be like, yeah, that's a cool color. I was actually initially trying to go a little bit later because I had a lot of work to do, but turns out he's like on a panel or something. And so I have to go earlier and I'm just really hoping that the panel doesn't start at like five because the event is from five to seven and I'm definitely showing up at like six at this rate. So hopefully he's not speaking right now and just looking for my super tall blonde head. That is what we're doing, so I should probably hurry up because right now I'm just slapping. Oh my God. See? Wow, that is some excellent dancing. And sitting. Goodbye, little dog. All right, it's raining, so let's go have fun finding parking downtown. Bye. All right, we're here. But I drove by the place and it is so full. I was like, isn't your store like three feet wide? Never get a partner. Never, never. <laughs> All right, so why is this notable? 
What? Air Force One high tops. So, how was your event? It was great. We uh, had a bunch of Nike people there doing Nike things. It was a Nike happy time. I was there for your panel. She was. She was there for the panel. Or so she claims. No, I watched I didn't see video the panel of it. <laughs> You want to watch the video? Uh, you um, could have gotten the video from anyone. Get out of my car. <laughs> Can't believe I'm alive. It's after 10 o'clock. Hi, I'm Lauren. I could be your grandmother. See, I'm obviously at home now, which is where I like to be. But the event went really well, so that was good. I got a t-shirt out of it also. Ooh, big pimping. So that was good for the little ding bay. But I think that I'm gonna end this vlog here. I hope that you enjoyed learning all about my face. I'm sure it was riveting for you. I'm pretty sure, I meant to say this earlier, I am pretty sure if you go to Face Reality's website, they have a list of some of the ingredients that are like commonly found in skincare and makeup that will typically break people out which I personally found to be very helpful. So when I first started going to this place that was one of the things that they gave me was they were like here's this list if you like just don't use anything that has this stuff in it because it's just gonna break you out. So if you are having some skin issues whether that be major or minor I definitely would check that list out and then just kind of like compare it with your products. There's a lot of stuff on it. Again everybody's skin is different so this won't guarantee anything but I think it's a good place to start and you do have to remember also like for stuff like that to just even get out of your skin it takes like three months but i myself i'm quite pleased with my results so definitely just give that site a little look see over and yeah that's everything for the vlog i hope that you enjoyed this learning about my face vlog <laughs> Ooh, worked my hamstrings out i regret but yeah i'm gonna go to sleep because i have to work tomorrow and my inner child is actually just an old lady so make sure that you like this video and subscribe to hissy fit if you're not already and until next time ta-ta <sighs>